just landed. First stop, Cracker Barrel. Obviously. Just arrived in sunny Florida. Had a chance to have breakfast at Cracker Barrel. Just stopped at Publix quickly for some water, some eggs, and our cousins are coming down here tomorrow because they are also going to join us on their uh, baby moon. And that is all. So this is what movie theaters look like in Naples, Florida. A little fancy. We're going to see Jumanji tonight. It's 8.45, a little tired. So hopefully I'll stay late. Get the food there. It's, oh, that's my finger. It's Friday morning in sunny Naples, Florida, second day of vacation. Uh, we're going to pick up our cousin later um, and her husband. They are also expecting a baby um, two weeks after me, so we're going to do the baby moon together. For now, it's like 10 o'clock, 10.30. I'm going to head to the little gym that they have in the development. Um, they have the, the machine that I like to use, the ARC trainer. So I'm going to try to see if I could do that and just see if I can get in shape for labor, <laughs> which I don't know if that's a thing, but um, trying to stay active. One thing, uh, we were supposed to clean the bathroom before um, the cousins got here, but obviously I've said it a couple times and now that we have to go pick them up in an hour. Rob is now deciding to look in the bathroom and I said, okay, can you clean the mirror? And... First of all, he didn't even see anything on the mirror. And then when he finally saw there was like toothpaste on the mirror, he's like, now how would I, how do I clean this? And I just thought that was the funniest question ever that, let's see, he's like, he's almost 26. And he really had to stop and think about how should I clean a mirror? And then he said, oh, Windex. So I just thought that was funny and that's gonna, I'm gonna bother him about that all day. Now how do I clean this? And now we'll see if hopefully he finds the Windex without me. <laughs> Ooh. All right, day three of the Florida trip. Obviously, have to get our Starbucks. Do you want to be in it or no? There's Mama number two, or, or number one, depends on who's asking. <laughs> Is there a small Mama number three? Or something? What? <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. Wait, we can't go That's out. That's Mambo, not Mama. Oh my Mama. God, Rob! I don't think we can go. <laughs> out. I, don't, I don't think we can go out this way. It's when you know that your husband is young when he thinks that the song Mamba, Mamba number five is Mama number five. Shit. Mama number, Mama, Mama number three. Mama, Mama number three. <laughs> Mambo. Yeah. How the hell are we out of here? Rob, I'm going to have to bleep this all out. You got to do a U-turn where, where that car just went. Don't go where that car went. Oh my oh. God. Don't go where that car went. What happened? I missed yeah. oh, it. Oh wow. Wow. I almost just did it too. Oh, oh so this is where we go. Fucking BMWs. Oh, it's an old lady. She's old as a dirt. She's a, what a asshole. Rob, <laughs> all right. So, apologize to all you people from Massachusetts. Oh, I didn't know she was There's probably three of them. <laughs> uh, we're going to go to Publix, get some... What are we getting? Food. What are we then, getting? <laughs> and then we're going to hit the beach. It's very exciting stuff. I have this. Stomach. I don't know if you can see our, our husbands in the background just Being talking to social. everyone in the store. Talking to older women. Let me see how it is. <laughs> That's it. What are we looking for now? Fruit? We're looking for Eggo waffles and fruit and Nutella. <laughs> Burger problems. So today's Saturday. We leave Tuesday and we're just going through and picking everything <laughs> from every aisle. Like it's we're moving in. Problems. Okay. <laughs> I'm about to get most problems. I don't know. I've never seen it before. Ready in 30 seconds. Ooh. Genius. <laughs> you want to send it to me or you want to take it on mine? I'll take it on yours. Alright, here you go. Ooh, that, those ones are cute. Exactly. So. Do you want me to hold the... Yeah, let's set the stage here. Wait, you gotta fix the hair first. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, just getting ready for my photo shoot. In the it's important. Okay, let's see. Cute. Put it a little more Wait, towards is my the front. Hair Almost. Just put a little more forward. Like hold it. Yes. There we go. <laughs> I don't even think. I think my. 
We made it to the beach. I'm so glad we did. There's this adorable bird just running around. Not not even flying, just running. Let's see that. We've got some pelicans going on. Wow. Ooh, there's the sun. Feel that. This is up close to the person. That's really good to do. Thank you. Thank you. Perfect. Thank you. This is my fun. So today we went to oh, really? the beach. Yeah, so we went to the pool. <laughs> Do you know I was filming? Were you just agreeing with me? <laughs> I think I was just yeah, telling yeah, you, yeah, recapping what we did. And now we're at dinner at Sushi Tai at Sushi Tai Two. Uh, we were supposed to eat inside, but the waiter like died or something. Been taken out in an ambulance and fire truck. So we're eating outside with some oh some hooligans. They're about to pull up again and play death metal music. And this lady next to us is wanting our husbands to get up and do something about it, which is not going to happen. Yeah, he's he's going to... Oh, we'll miss him, though. He's in front of that restaurant. Um, then after this, we're going to get some ice cream and then you watch serious? a movie. Same people? Same people, yeah. I don't know if you guys can hear the bocelli in the background of the Italian restaurant next to us, but it goes great with the chicken teriyaki, the chicken yakisoba the boys have, and got some good chicken pad thai. Polished off some rice. It's another night in Naples. Can't tell if it's Naples, Italy, or Florida. <laughs> You can almost smell it from the camera. <laughs> Had to uh, <laughs> come back, shower, change, go to Mercado for a bit, check out the scene down there, and then go to Sophia's. Head into Starbucks now. Starbucks. Last full day of the trip. Very sad, but it said it's supposed to be cloudy, but it looks like we got really some sunny. sun. So we gotta take <laughs> yeah, take advantage of it while we can. Um, <laughs> pretty much everyone down here watches their car three times a day, which is interesting. And pretty much every day that they say the weather, it's the exact opposite. Yeah. <laughs> so it's been saying that it's going to thunder and lightning all day the past two days, and so I've been freaking out about it, but it's been really nice yesterday and today. So, yay. <laughs> oh, you can use that gas. All right. Okay. Change plan. Yeah, we don't need to put an X, X on into the rental car. Rob, where are we going? Uh, to get what? Yes. Oh my god. What? Fuel? Splash and dash. Splash and dash. <laughs> dash. I said it wrong. Splash and dash. Splash and dash. What is this? Oh, new one dropping. New one's coming. Like this video if you've Red ever creep. splashed. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. There's trucks everywhere. We're about to die. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. Wow, this guy. Oh, that boy. was a nice. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> oh boy, we're going to. Oh my god. Okay. These Ew. Floridians are. No, Great. I felt like we don't. Yeah, we love everyone. All right, let's on see. This so video. we have tomorrow we're leaving. So, and we need to get it as low as possible. So maybe five bucks. You need five bucks. Is good. So for like those of you that don't know what a splash and dash but means, you just give the car a splash uh -huh. of gas and, and then, then you dash. dash. dash it's a race car. You dash off. It's a right race car term. Race car is this thing. diesel? Well, watch out for the. Oh. Yeah, let's not put diesel in the rental car though. Oh, that's a beauty. Check it out. All right. And then we're going to...